Alright, so first what you have to do is, well, I recommend getting this Cooler Master PC fan. I'll let that focus, maybe. There, so now you know what fan it is. I recommend getting this one because it has nine fins, and the more fins you have, the more air it, it pulls. So, I recommend getting this one. Or one with nine fins, but cooler. I would recommend Cooler Master because if this is going to be a 12 volt fan mod for the Xbox One S, but it's going to be si not completely silent, but it's going to be it's not going to be loud. So in the old 360 Slim, when you open it up, you'll find this, but it'll have yellow and blue wires. All you have to do is pull this out. Then, what you do is, there will be yellow in, if it focuses, there will be a yellow and a blue wire in here. All you want to do is, stupid phone, these little tabs in there, these little white tabs, in there that you kind of see with the lines in between them you want to pull those up on the yellow and blue one and then you'll be left with the black and the red because that's all you need for this 12 volt fan mod what you're going to do is on the fan you're going to have these little these little horn things faced up this if i can get this to focus The one on the outer side, right here, where my finger is pointing, that's the negative. The one in the middle is the positive. What you're going to do is, see if I can set this up somehow. Maybe. <clears throat> there, I got to make some stuff. What you're going to do is, you're going to take this red one, if this thing focuses, you're going to take this red one, here i got to manually focus it, you're going to kind of like, you're going to twist the totes really, really fine. You're going to stick it in the middle, in this middle pin, if you can get it in there. And stick it in the middle pin, and this is just a crappy example. But and then you're gonna stick the black one in that pin. Then you're gonna get duct tape and make sure it's tight and around there. Make sure the black and red don't touch. And then after you do that, you're gonna come down here, and you're gonna you're gonna come down here and. You're going to plug this in, and it's going to be a little bit tough, so give me a minute. There, now that that's plugged in, and this is if all this is hooked up, all your wires hooked up, you're going to take this fan, your Cooler Master fan or whatever one you have, you're going to take that, you're going to put it on the heat sink, make sure that these are facing up. Make sure that the um, arrows, if there's arrows on this one, no there's not. This side, where you can see the fan, goes down. Make sure it's in there. And then, you're going to kind of line it up with the, let's see if I can do this, the little, like where the little grate is on the heat sink. You're going to get screws that fit that. And you're going to screw it in, in all four corners, or you can do diagonal, if that's all that works for you. And then you're going to hook everything up, and you're going to put everything back together. 
you need to turn it on and it will work. So let me see if I can get this to work. No. No. It should work, as you can see. Now turn on the Xbox. Turn on the Xbox. And it is working. And now you have blue LEDs or red or whatever color. Yeah, I don't I don't care what color I get as long as it works. Green would be better with Xbox and Xbox is green. But yeah, that's how you do that little fan mod thing. It should keep your console cooler and It's not even loud. Like, subscribe, comment. I don't care what you do. If you want more tutorials and stuff like this, just comment below. Comment below. And I'll do this. If you want to tear down the Xbox One S, I'll do that. If you want to tear down the 360, I'll do that. Don't really bother me. And you want to make sure you got these wires all... I'm going to unplug this. Want to make sure you got these wires all wrapped up so they don't spark or short out or nothing so you don't kill your console all right well that's it guys infinity 12 out